<clears throat> I love her. She's a great actress. I have no idea what this is about. How have you been feeling? Have you been sleeping any better? Oh, well. She's great. Also. And again, I never slept well before. I was condition. Condition? It's called pregnancy. It's okay to say it out loud. What? Something's happened. Can you just please drive? Did you see something? What is happening? Apocalypse. What's going on? People describe seeing an entity that takes on the form of your worst fears. Oh my god. What are you looking at? What did you see? What is wrong with you? Please stop it! Wow. We can't stay here. Every contact we have had with the outside has brought us death. Your kids. They deserve hope. Every single decision I have made has been for them. So it's sort of like a quiet place. It's coming. <laughs> oh, that's why she covers her eyes. We are going on the trip now. It's going to be rough. Hold on! If you hear something in the woods, you tell me. If you hear something in the water, you tell me. This is so intense. But under no circumstance are you allowed to take off your blindfold. Do you hear that? Bird box. I am so sorry if I have my mouth open throughout the video. I just ate some hot Cheetos and my tongue is burning up. Ah, honestly, huh. look, uh -huh. very, very red tongue and I'm feeling very warm because of that, but let's move on. I couldn't help but be reminded of a quiet place. Here, instead of the sound, which is the main character slash main Thing about a quiet place, here we're gonna go with sight, which is another sense. It's a very interesting plot, you know, this entity or whatever this is takes the form of what you fear the most, so it's sort of like the Bogarts in Harry Potter, which is a powerful thing because the thing you fear the most is the thing that you would not know what to do, you know, in case you're facing your biggest fear, you are afraid. So you're not thinking straight. So it's very clever for these creatures to take the form of what you fear most. Note that. So this movie is gonna deal with your senses, which is something that really caught my attention. Love Sandra Bullock. She is one of my favorite actresses. And Sarah Paulson is great as well. And it looks like their relationship in the film is gonna be something very close. So I'm very excited to see them work together again. We just saw them in Ocean's 8. This movie also deals with your fears. You know, fear is something that we can all relate to. So this straight up makes you relate to the characters. You know, you see yourself in their shoes because we all have experienced fear and it's something that we cannot escape. Similar to the video I posted yesterday, the escape room, this is dealing with your fears. So it's a decision that you have to make based on your biggest fear and your loved ones. So it's a similar plot. I am up for thrillers. These are my favorite kind of movies that are not, you know, um, action movies or animated films, romantic comedies, I love thrillers. A movie that really makes you feel what the characters are feeling and this seems just like it because the trailer made me feel a lot of emotions and it's just the trailer. It's a Netflix movie so I really want to see it. Don't think we're gonna get a release date in the cinema so we're gonna have to wait till we get that on Netflix but I am very interested in it. I saw people reacting to it on Stardust. I had no idea what the trailer was about 
and it caught my attention and it is most likely on my list of movies to watch. What about you guys? What did you think about this trailer? Are you excited for the movie or not? Let me know in the comments. If you like this video, make sure you leave a thumbs up, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Here's my other social media if you want to talk to me or contact me. Follow me on Stardust at Minute Movie Pop and I will see you soon. Vi a muchas personas en Stardust hacer reacción a este trailer. Solo alcancé a ver que Sandra Bullock está en la película y es una de mis actrices favoritas. No sabía de qué se trataba, vi el trailer y la verdad me interesó muchísimo. Es parecido al video que subí ayer. Son decisiones que tienes que hacer, pero esta vez es basada en el miedo. Todo mundo se puede relacionar con el miedo porque es un sentimiento que todos hemos sentido alguna vez en nuestra vida. Es algo que no podemos escapar, el miedo es, pasa cuando menos te lo esperas. Y esto me recordó un poquito a Harry Potter, los Bogarts que toman la forma de lo que más temes. Es algo parecido, las criaturas se convierten en tu mayor temor. Que es muy inteligente porque una persona cuando tiene miedo no está pensando claramente, entonces eso te hace como chin, vulnerable. Y pues más fácil para ellos de matarte o no sé qué es lo que hacen con las personas. Es inevitable no acordarme de A Quiet Place, esa película está muy aquí porque la acabo de ver hace poco, porque salió este año y fue una de mis películas favoritas. En vez de ser audio el principal personaje, la principal fuente de comunicación va a ser ahora otro sentido, es la vista. Por eso se tapan los ojos, porque no quieren que esta cosa se convierta en su mayor temor y pues los haga hacer cosas que no quieren hacer, como matarse, como la muchacha que voltea el carro. Muy interesante, la verdad. Es una película de Netflix. No estoy segura si va a salir en el cine o no, no creo. Pero de igual manera estoy muy emocionada. Cuando un trailer capta mi atención así y me hace sentir tanto, es una película que va a estar en mi lista de lo que voy a ver. ¿A ustedes les llamó la atención la película sí o no? Díganme en los comentarios si te gustó este video. Dale like. Sígueme en Stardust. Estoy como Minute Movie Pop. Aquí están mis otras redes sociales por si quieren seguirme. Y como siempre, suscríbanse a mi canal y nos vemos pronto.